Hi, uh, in this video, I will show you how to create a scale bar in the images uh, that you captured from uh, microscopes of like uh, any digital or analog Olympics or evolves these kinds of microscopes. So there are two types of image you may get. One contain the inbuilt uh, scale bar, which you may need to revise or update as per your requirements or in another image there could be a file which is uh, not with the original scale bars so there are two type uh, two different um, approaches to input the scale bars on the images so today i will show you i will show you um, in the uh, scale bar contained images how to input your uh, scale bar and you can customize this scale bar on that image so at first i uh, open this image j fiji software so this is freely available uh, in the website and it is compatible both for mac and windows and then i will open my uh, interest image here okay so that's the image so I want to customize these uh, scale bar. So these these image already have this scale bar on that. So how can I do this? For that, I have to at first uh, measure this scale bar and then uh, rate a um, resolution for that. I will have to select these uh, tool here, the line tool, and then I have to uh, make a line of that image yes and then I have to go to analyze and then set scale so this is the scale I want to set and I know this is 200 micrometer so I will so it, this is the pixel so it will be the default of that image from where I just got this image so it depends on the instrument which pixel uh, it is working and then the known distance I know this is 200 micrometers so I'll input 200 there and pixel aspect ratio says as, as this is already given there so it should be one and in other microscope you'll get uh, 1.6 or something so so it depends on how the ratio uh, when you're measuring this uh, when you're capturing these images and the unit will be micrometer you can just simply write um and it will be converted to micrometer when the software will um, calculate this so there is an option here global so this global means uh, if you have the similar type of image which has this uh, same pixel and distance you know so you can make these as a standard and you can just um, you know, calculate the uh, and, and import the scale bar so as part of these uh, calculations so it is better to to do every time this setting scale and then measuring the mm, and importing the scale bar but if you are certain that all the images contain the similar distance and similar pixel then you can set it to global it is a continuous process here so i will select global here and then i will click okay after that so if you want the whole image and you want your desired um, scale to be imported there just leave it like that but here this scale bar is also um, shown so better if you just can uh, crop the image so what you can do you can select this um, square and then the area you want to represent so suppose this one and then go to image and crop okay and then so you got the crop image here and now you have to import your scale so go to analyze and then tool and then you'll find the scale bar so when you click the scale bar you will get some options so how how the width of the scale bar you want so this um, suppose if you want the 20 micrometer scale bar so you'll write 20 and everything will be just as default here okay so font says you may want this more or less so there is already one scale bar 
at the bottom so you can change the color if you if you select uh, black then it will be black so better for this image better to select white and the background if you want um, white background or black background that's fine it will be created like that but i'll just want to make none and then the location i have selected lower right so if you, if you, you can also select the other positions here of your interest and then the bold text so the text some some in some images the text is not actually desired maybe so at that time you will click on hide text so that text will not be uh, shown here and the font is sure if you want to input the text here so that's that's a thing and and uh, and you'll click okay for that and after that so another question might be raised from you whether the scale bar I imported is this really 20 micrometer in the cropped option yes so after when I crop this then it will automatically adjust the length of that and and this is the 20 micrometer after the cropping image not in the previous one so for for referencing if I just go to the back and then uh, do this um, scale bar you'll find very tiny so now you can see that I crop this area so which was a bit bigger and then I crop the whole thing here it is smaller so yes whenever you are cropping this it will automatically be adjusted and the scale will be also adjusted according to the uh, crop size of the series so that's all and now you can save these um, into different um, I mean of your interest of uh, uh, format so jpeg and gif tf so everything is there so i will save these as a uh, suppose this one in desktop so yeah i got this so now if i open this yes yeah that's the image i, I created later so i modified this so yeah so that's all this is the procedure you can just um you can import the scale bar here for one option of the images which contain already scale bar and which doesn't contain the scale bar i'll show you in the next uh, video how to do this so until that enjoy research bye